This is a pumpkin leaf. Regular pumpkin leaf, guys. And I've never known that this can be eaten, right? So we're going to find out from the Afrocentric chef himself, Chef Alkali Bayete Boom Boom, as he show us how to prepare the pumpkin leaf and how to eat the pumpkin leaf. If you're interested like me, I suggest that you stick around and watch this full video. My name is Tyrone and this is Tyrone Studio. And you're always welcome here to subscribe and like this video and comment and be a part of the whole entire family. All right, so hear what? Peace and love unto you and blessings always. Click those notification bell so they upload every Sunday at 7.30 p.m. Local time, you never miss it, all right? One love and peace. Soon come. Action. Yo, yo, yo. Walk on. Anyway, people, we are just going down the hills, you know. Take a look at walk. We're going to hunt one thing them called nightshade. You know? It's a nightshade bush. And it's related to eggplant. It's related to pepper, bell pepper, hot pepper. Um, what else? Tomato. Yep. Um... Tomato. Mm. Yeah, tomatoes are nice shade. And I'm saying I'm good to eat. Could you believe it? Could you believe the Irish potato is a nice shade food? Yeah. Yeah. Long to nice shade for me. So people, this is nightshade, right? So this is a good kind to eat. You see these berries here? These are the good berries to eat. But some people say they are poisonous and all them stuff there. And they, in the old time days of the medieval times. They used to make toxin with it and kill the people. <laughs> Could you believe that? But the Africans have been eating it for years. So we're going to pick some of this leaf right here. Pick some of the leaf then. So I'm going to make some vegetable these. I'm going to show you. We can also research it on the internet to the people. What black shade, uh, nightshade is. You understand? So what I've noticed, the poison one, is basically have the red berries. You have red and green, but this is the black one. You see the purple? And if you open the berries, people, it don't look like tomato inside. They got the seed of tomato. See it? Right. And it can eat it. Very much nutritious food to eat. So the Africans be eating this, especially the ones in East Africa. Be eating this for many, many, many years. And there's a lot of vegetables in your backyard where I mean you can actually eat. You know? This is nightshade, this is black nightshade. Alright, and this grows in Jamaica. Alright, from the month of what you can call it, you can also find it in Jamaica. From August, September, October, November, December. And that's it, you won't see it until probably next year. And this is a member of the uh, tobacco family. You hear that, Tyrone? Yeah. So peeps, we're gonna eat some nightshade today with some different backyard vegetables. I understand Jamaica is full of these vegetables. I mean, yo, you know something I was thinking the other day, people? Like why Africa is so full of all these natural animal beasts, you know? Cause we was never a meat eaters. We only eat meat you know, like on a holiday or a ceremony, but we always eat vegetables. Vegetables, people. So, I'm going to pick some callaloo leaf, people. See? I'm going to pick some callaloo leaf. Some callaloo leaf, yeah? I'm going to pick some callaloo leaf so that they can go with this stuff. Just people see all it now, follow there. See there? Cow. A bush deer today. Why are, you, why are you telling people my name? Yeah? My name is Chef Boom Boom, people. Don't miss me. You hear him say? <laughs> Leighton. People, what is my name? Chef Boom Boom, <laughs> but AKA Layton, you don't know. <laughs> so, Alkali. <laughs> By Yete Boom Boom. Yeah, man. Otherwise known as the Afrocentric yeah. Chef. Tell you, tell you. So bush Kalalo. Yeah, Bush Kalalo. So I just pick the leaf then. Pick some leaf, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have some fresh one over here. Nice, fresh one. Nice, fresh one. In peeps, that's why Tyrone love come a country you now. Free food, look here. <laughs> eh? Eh? Food that country you now. I drop off a tree, I we pick it off of the tree. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm.
So right people, so what, what you're doing right, you want to catch the pumpkin that is close to the edge. See, you just take out this, this. All right, I get a few more. All right, all right. I'm good with this now. So let's go. It's some nice vegetable. All right. So here we are, right? Now the kitchen here. So, so we have the pumpkin leaf already. We'll put that some water. And then we have a tomato leaf. You understand? We have a callaloo leaf. You understand? And that's it. So we just make it go and soak in so. And a little bit. We're gonna add some water to it. And salt. So you get any little rodents or any something, something on it. Go back to your it is half impossible. You know, I'm starting to go and so for a minute. And people, look. Some people say the nightshade is poisonous, but Africans have been eating it for years. You know, I'm starting for years. So, there's a lot of things about the nightshade food, especially when it comes to tomato. It's nightshade. When it comes to um, pepper, the bell pepper, the sweet pepper, and the hot pepper, is considered being as a nightshade food. Irish potato, the eggplant, and tobacco is considered being as a nightshade food. And doctors say that if you eat it, and look how long people eat. When them you know eggplant, look how long people are when them they are eat Irish potato. Look how long people are eat all these things. You understand? That is considered nightshade. So let's go soak it off right here. Wet my hand. Boom, boom. So we're gonna eat this with some fish, right? So you know, so we didn't buy the fish today. We we just wash the fish about. Did them scale them up so I don't know just make sure so no no left teens are left in here no intestines are left so I'm gonna use some of my vinegar right here white vinegar vinegar then I have a look at lime alright one on one I stab on our 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 gunshot which one our cut so I'll put some lime in it Right. And then we're gonna wash it off, making sure so they get rid of that that smell, that rawness. Woo! Okay. So the rawness they don't know, right? So with my with my I make this special cloud people. This is for just basically getting the fish dry as possible. So if we put it down at home, I want to have a nice piece of cloth, especially the white one. See, you just take the fish out. And dry them off. Dry them off completely. Dry them off. Dry them. Completely dry them off. You know? All the inside. Dry the inside people. And then we're done. We just take some soap water and some bleach. And just wash it off. So I think wash out your cloth. Yeah, wash out my cloth. Okay. Mm. Taryn, are you telling me about her? <laughs> wash out your cloth. <laughs> So, look at the fish in the side, just dry it out, you know? Alright, come off of me. Stay right there, very quick. See? Get all of that thing out of the fish there. It's the same thing you do with this one. Season of fish already, just basically salt and black pepper. You understand? So the oil is well, well hot. You understand? Coconut oil. You understand? Let's go on. So it's right here. The nice kid will make it warm boil up again. Same time to wash up my plate and make it up with it. That's the name of this fish bumbum. 
This is regular I can't know. This is when they this man, Jack Mastic. Mm. And this is a regular football fish. Big ugly fish. Okay. <laughs> so the Jack Mastic. Mm. Mm. So this is the last part of the nice day, you know. That we just boil it three times, right? Yeah, I'll bite it three times. So I'll cut up the rest of the vegetables and put it in it. Alright? Yeah, can I get more? So this is the pumpkin meat. So you now strip it just like what you now strip it. Um, so we'll strip on it. This is basically what you now strip on. Can we do it this way? So go all the way down. Sit. Easy, easy one, two, three. All right, that's it for that one. And you know, people, I'm always giving these interesting like, food to eat, you know what I mean? You know, backyard. Mm, backyard garden. Uh, Funky leaf. Yeah. Uh, banana. Soccer. <laughs> banana hat. Ah, these are good things. So, yeah, some people. I remember this is young pumpkin leaf. It's not the old, old ones. So you want to get the ones that are at the beginning of the root. Yeah, it's not at the end of the pumpkin. You know, that run. You find a way to run at the last part and just pick the young ones. Half of it. So yeah, man, have to do So we have this here, tomato leaf, tomato leaf, tomato leaf, all of these. And then more tomato leaf. See? Uh, one more pumpkin leaf in here. Cut this off. So ladies and gentlemen, let me put some I in the pot that can just say hot. Alright, watch out. I'm just putting my vegetables in there. Alright. My onion, my carrion, and my tomato and my scotchy. And I just make this one saute. First before we put in everything else. Saute in a nice little saute, you know, to make everything. Okay. So I'm just gonna add in the vegetables. Pumpkin leaves, last time. Everything in there. Big up to all vegetarians right. watching this video. To all the vegans and all the meat eaters. Big up everybody. You know what I mean? Yes, sir. So, nice shade. Okay, I put in a nice yeah, shade. Put in a nice put in a lamb shade. Yeah, lamb shade, man. Whatever. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God, I can't manage it. Right. Yeah. I'm just turning this up on a bit. Like last time. Jamaican people can't be hungry, you know? Hungry. Nobody not be hungry. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> we love to watch rice half flour. Oh, no. Ah, KFC. Yeah. So you just add a little bit of water to it now, people. Raw water? No, just regular water. So we just boil the water already. Okay. Ah, uh, salt. Okay. Make it go and simmer down a little bit, you know? Mm -hmm. So ladies and gentlemen, remember me to put on the water for the ugali, right? So it's two cup of water, see? So I'm going to put one cup of this of water in the pot already. This is going to be the second cup now, right? So make it go and boil up and stuff like that. Meanwhile, so we are getting rid of the lumps. The lumps. As much as possible. It's just like fufu. It's just like preparing fufu, you know? So we get out the lump out of it. So I'm going to turn my stuff down a little bit. Alright, so let's make it up the lump the more tight. Alright. Let's go for the spoon now, since we get it out of it. Alright. 
bone. And if you never get out the lump of it, you don't do it that way yeah, and get out the lump. But I get the lump out of it. See? So, and believe you me, people, I know I'm not going up on the self because this is hot. This is really, really hot. What you going to go on like it heavy? No. What you going to go on like it heavy, people? Like you going to put my whole heap of weight. Watch him. That, I, I just saw the African them do it. That's how you get that style, you know? Yeah. Not true. So, this is the Ugali. All of the African them, big up with the self in that yeah. video. You see? Yeah. And usually, some of them would add a little bit of dry corn in it. Mm. Yeah. Go that way. Move one more. Action! Quiet on the set! Quiet on the set! So, we're gonna see how this. Is turning out right. So, this is the proper way of taking out the ugali. So, when you flip the pot, if it don't drop out, it's not gonna look good. So, here we go. Rock coffee, AJ. Wop, wop. And later on, we can make chips with it. Oh, that guy. Yeah, it's gonna Yeah, I'm an edge. Oh, I Yeah, I'm an edge. Right. So I'm gonna take the hot water the spoon, and just shape it. <laughs> shape it. <laughs> yeah, shape it. Yeah, shape it more. Make it look presentation, you know? So at this very moment, boom boom is shaping the ugali. Yeah, water. Boom boom is shaping the ugali with a little bit of warm water. Water. Yep. And the cameraman is talking in the background, mm -hmm. trying to be funny when he's not. Yeah. Trying to be funny <laughs> when he's not. All right, people. So, we're shaping up you guys, right? But like I said, Thomas, we're right, that is. Oh, people, we're going to cut up the you guys, yeah? Now, this is Tyrone fish, and this is my fish. Oh. Swim around. Swim around. <laughs> Alright. So, this is the vegetable. Two dips. That's my plate. Tyrone, want no vegetable? Can you dump it up? So we're eating nice shade food. But I think I've seen it all. Have a seat. Uh, now you eat your uh, garlic with your hand. So let's see. If you want more, you take more. Get tired of us. Time. Well, land, well, land, my time. Swear people are food them on. Yeah, I'm going to Swear people, my you got it. Oh. My you got it. Oh. Got it. Alright, people, it's another day when you see me on the channel. I eat food. I'm going to just go eat food on the channel. If you just eat food, but I do. What is Big up yourself. So, guys, this is a culinary experience of Chef Boom Boom. This is the Ugali, which is aka turn corn meal, and this is um vegetable which mm -hmm. is pumpkin leaf, nightshade, tomato leaf mm -hmm. and uh, not all spices. We are a little bit of tomato and so on and this is the fish here. Mm -hmm. Right? So let us pray before we eat. Father we thank you for this food. Thank you. Thank you for this blessing again. Thank you for boom boom subscribers and Let's pour it to your mercies upon us, God, as we tell you thanks for this food. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Guys, road to 40k subscribers. If you haven't subscribed it, I come on to the team. Join the team. You understand? Yeah, man. I'll be a thing that will go on over here. And hit that notification bell. Alright? So, let us dig in. Boom, boom. What's up, What's up, Wait, what you must say, Pete? Lord, you want to give me. I'm gonna give you herbs and the land if you uh, eat. Okay. Mmm. <laughs> yeah. Kaladoo. Bush. Mouse. Mmm. 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 Mmm.
Mostly eat push people. No. La 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 la. <laughs> people. The right amount of flavor. Even though that you're eating bush right here, this. The wild colour Bush colour Pumpkin leaf. Pumpkin leaf. Really nice. Why? Paper. Okay. Yeah, I hear the real outside people. It are real. For what the people may not have no appetite like that, you know. I don't know what. But I don't eat no whole of food. That one thing. Yeah. You eat this though. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you need to uh, come calm you with it. Right. Nice. Yeah, there's a wave one though, or you need some water. Mm -hmm. The only thing with me and fish, I really eat fish to all Because guess what? I have to take too much time to pick up bone. Mm -hmm. So you really want the filet? Mm -hmm. It's a filet first. Yeah. Oh, what? See the man, bro. the gandum man. Bro! Gandum. <laughs> bro! I think more gandum you. <laughs> It's like it's like when you, when you make it like this. Yeah. It's some like I, I, I want only for carbon dioxide like. Yeah. <laughs> that like root not fermented. Mm -hmm. Fermented. So hold well, on. Um, people can get this to buy, right? They can ship this to somebody. Yeah. yeah make it. I just want to know maybe. Wow. Eh. Eh. Hold on. Let me let me serve you. Let me serve you. We have to serve you. We have to serve it up to the glass. Yeah. Smell like sorry, Lee. Yep. Mm mm. Chubby. Guys, cheers to nearly reaching 40k subscribers. If you're checking in at this time on the premiere, I right, watch this. We upload that. Uh, not really upload the premiere. The premiere again. If you rewatch this video, replay this video, big up yourself. Outside. Taste it. Taste it. Mm -hmm. Woo! Woo! Very. Yo. Yo. Yeah. Yeah! Why <laughs> <Wine> what? <laughs> this dude! You never know so many camera Boom wine. boom 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 boom! Hmm? Yo, yo people, me now be extra the pimento! We're in at this! Taste it. Woo! Bad dude. It is, you hear that? It tastes like soda. But it don't have any. Acid like more than the ginger. That yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah, yeah, the ginger fermenter mm -hmm. give you that 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 flavor, that that little frothy acidic mm -hmm. kind of thing. Plus, this is a natural acid itself because it's a fruit. Mm -hmm. listen, listen to it. Speaking to you like. Now bring them that. I may speak to it. Bad man, people. I may say bad. <sighs> one more, one more people. Nah, no, drinking. Nah, no, drinking. It's like sparkling wine. So Tyrone is not drinking to be drunk. Mm -hmm. But if it stay a little bit longer, it turn wine. Yes. If you go like a little longer, to one days. Then, it, then, then if you bring it to a distill, it turn right in a rum. Boom. <laughs> it turn right in a rum, and then that the time it have a drunk. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yo, people, it is, it people, is what? yo, listen, now, man. If you want the red bean or wine, yeah, I put a number in the description. Boom, boom, you can start it off here. Plus, you have banana, you can make banana wine, mm -hmm. right? wine. guinea wine, what other wine? Star apple, star apple wine, Neesberry star wine. fruit wine, Neesberry wine, Neesberry wine. Mm -hmm. any, fruit, any fruit, any fruit, any mm fruit, -hmm. any Trouble man, jackfruit, why? Mm -hmm. Ooh! I be here again, yeah, why? You know, you know, yeah, something with me. Breadfruit, why? I don't want no breadfruit. Banana! Banana, no, banana, no, banana, no, breadfruit, why? Breadfruit, I make the food ripe. Ooh! Yeah, man, you have to make it right. Now, I'm going to look at the same one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, people. So, one more cheers, my boss. I know, can I make wine too? One more cheers. Mm -hmm.
Casher, 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 yes, Casher, yeah, Casher, 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 when you blend it and then you make it sit and then and then tomorrow you now you start to process it what? 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 when you boil it when you waste it waste it when you boil it when you blend it yeah you kill everything doctor said you that's you kill all of the, the, the nutrients when you boil or cook the food when you eat it as it is you get the best you know what I mean? yeah man alright so people I want to tell you a big, big thank you for watching today's video. Tuning in to the premiere. You understand? Chef Boom Boom with the clean up long time. You hear what? One love again. This is the general. Where where, where, where are you? Alkali Bayete Boom Boom. Alkali what? Alkali Bayete Boom Boom. Alkali Bayete. Bayete is a South African word from the Zulu Reserve. Yeah, for and Boom Boom and the jump. People, peace and blessings to you. Yeah, big up everybody always tuning for the live and new subscribers. Thank you very much. We love and appreciate you. And peace and God be with you all. One love again. Outside. Boom!